Tom Eaves. What a hero! That didn't really work because my chair was upright. Hang on. Tom Eaves, you hero! What a man! What a man! Stubbed on. First touch of the ball. It's what he does. It's what he does. Fabulous. It's brilliant. It's brilliant. 2 1 win. We made, we made it hard for ourselves, definitely. Our weakness definitely is scoring goals. But. Yeah. Scoring goals is something we need to work on. But. When we are doing stuff like that, late goals, it's, this, this is a, this is a, this is a team that is league winners, do you know what I mean? If you want to get promoted, if you want to win the league, you have to score late goals. You have to push until the very, very last minute. That's what we did. The substitutions worked. Eves came on, did the job, scored the goal. Brilliant. Saw a tweet during the game. All I want for Christmas is a second goal against Doncaster. Well, in the first game... Of, of December. That's what we did. It was his first touch of the ball. The goal. What happened? It was a corner. It was whipped in. It was cleared. Someone tried to get a body on it. I'm watching it back here in slow motion. So the corner was cleared. Greaves couldn't get there. Bounced out to Smallwood who shot. Takes a few deflections. The keeper spills it and it falls right for Eves on the edge of the six yard box. The keeper's distraught. Eves is loving life. Callum Elder's loving life. Everyone is loving life. I know that in my living room. I was so, so happy with that one. Um, yeah. Fabulous. First touch of the ball. Second goal of the game. The winning goal. The winning goal. Um, for McGuinness's one in the first half, free kick. We had... I'm trying to see who it was. You know, I've, I've just seen the goals back now. We had Smallwood Wilkes... Honeyman Elder, McGuinness and Emmanuel all stood near it. Elder was stood a little bit more to the side. So it was more... This is from just outside the D, left side of the D. It's going to be a right-footed whipper like that. Elder is stood on the edge of the 18-yard box to the left of... Um, of... So the ball's here, McGuinness is there, Elder is stood there. In this cluster where McGuinness is, Honeyman, McGuinness, Wilkes, Smallwood, Emmanuel. I knew what we were going to do as soon as all of them stood around it. We had Doherty, Adelican and Elder in the box vicinity, if you will. I knew that what was going to happen, one of them was going to play it short to one of the other, well, to one of the others... One of the five was going to play it to one of the other four and they were going to try and rocket it past the keeper. Honeyman was going to take it. Was he going to bend it into the top bins? Was he going to hit it against the wall? Or was he going to play it square? Play it square is exactly what Mr George Honeyman would do. As the referee blows his whistle, he plays it short to McGuinness who from the absolute limit of the edge at D, absolutely rockets it. It's right on the it's right on the edge of the D. It's on the line. Rockets it to the keeper's to the keeper's um, left lower left hand side. 
He's brilliant. He's brilliant. Oh. It's it's lovely. It's lovely. Thing is, it should have been more comfortable than it was. For their goal, it was... Yeah, it was depressing watching that go in. Because you, you just saw it bounce. I'm just trying to find their goal now so I can... Relive it. Yeah, it's not giving me an explanation of the goal really here, which is great. But yeah, uh, all, uh, from what I remember was just a couple of bounces, shot from John Jules, takes a little niggle and then just bounces over the line. Ingram can't get there. And at that point I was, I was sweating. I was like, oh, no, 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 again, no, again, no, again, no. But we, we played it to a T. T for Tom Eaves. Yes. But yeah, I'm just trying to find their goal now. But we should we it, we it should have been more comfortable for us. It should have been more comfortable for us. But yeah. I'm not sure. I can find their goal. Yeah, Evesley, what a hero. What a hero. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not sure if you can see me here, but I'm loving life. But we should have made it more simple for us. Adelican had chances. Doherty had chances. We should have had a penalty. We should have had a penalty. We should have had a penalty. So Malik Wilkes running through on goal. The keeper dives to grab the ball. Grabs hold of Wilkes's ankle. Brings him down. Ref books Wilkes. He blew the whistle. Waited five seconds to, you know, see what he was going to choose. And... But Wilkes, when there's clear contact, the keeper gets nothing of the ball. He's going for the ball as it dribbles past him. He gets nothing of it. So instead... Hang on. Instead... This is Malik Wilkes, look. This is Malik Wilkes. Instead of getting the ball, which is being kicked in front of Malik Wilkes, he dives and then just grabs Wilkes by the ankle like that. Wilkes goes down. Ref says, nah, simulation, get stuffed. Anyway, I, I don't care what a man Tom Eaves is. This has been a mess, but I really don't care. Thank you very much for watching. If you got bored, I don't blame you. I, there's no structure to this anymore. Uh, yeah, see you later. Bye-bye.